Hey, it's your boy Bobby Beast. We want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is why Tariq took out Junior. Now, along, I'm definitely one of those people who have speculated, thinking that Junior was most definitely the brother of Brayden, that he could potentially be Ghost's and Angela's child at the side that nobody knows about. But all that speculation died when Tariq put that bullet in that man. So when it comes down to why did Tariq eventually take out Junior and, and somewhat brought everything full circle into the series while doing it? Well, I'm going to tell you why. Junior pretty much was an opponent for Tariq last season. He was the hidden hand. And even though he was a new DEA agent, he also was very good at his job. He was very smart and he was on top of things. And he was doing things nobody else would do. He would even disguise himself as a bum to try to get information on Tariq as much as possible but in the end it was Tariq who ended up defeating him and the entire DEA FBI and everybody that was coming for him at the very end and of course Junior couldn't let the situation go as we saw he was doing the most in the episode where he pretty much said that he was going to still try to go after Tariq as much as he possibly can where he talked to Blanca about this and Blanca told him to let it go however he went to his mother about it and said that he was still going to try to do something to bring Tariq down and so in the end, it resulted in him um, looking around for Tariq only to find him in the parking lot of Stansfield. Now, when it comes down to it, Junior really set himself up because the drive that Sachs gave him was giving him information on certain destinations and was opening the door for him to know about things, not only like about Tariq and the Tejadas, but also Noma, Obi and others. And so with this, Tariq used that as leverage to get a truce out of Noma because really it was like, Junior was the piece he was looking for. And when Junior ran his mouth a little too much, Tariq was thinking the entire time about how he can use it to his advantage, to which an assassin showed up at this time and this resulted in a shootout with, with Junior taking out the assassin, but only for Tariq and Brayden to get the jump on Junior and to result into talking to Noma to let him know that he is the only one who has links to her and who knows about her and that if he does not, you know, if this person is not stopped, he's going to be the one that would take her down. This resulted in Noma calling a truce, which pretty much resulted in Tariq taking out Junior Valdez. But the last words is everything that <laughs> really it like hits for me. Tariq told him, you know, ever since your aunt entered my life, my father was never the same. She was the worst thing to happen to him. But then again, she never really cared for my father in the end, and obviously you didn't either. Now, why did Tariq say, why didn't you care about my father either? Because it was Ghost who paid for Junior's education for him to become a DEA agent. So even though it was Ghost's money that helped got him through college, Junior didn't care. He made up in his mind that Ghost was still <laughs> nothing and that he was going to take down Tariq. Because a lot of people where Ghost is not around anymore, a lot of people wants to take revenge towards Tariq because he's not there. And Tariq has proven to be an opponent, just as much like his father, a very tough opponent. The thing is, though, in the end, those final words really did brought everything full circle with Tariq taking out Junior and ending the storyline effectively between the St. Patrick's and the Valdez with one Valdez still standing in the form of Pox. Who is the reason why uh, now Don Carter has entered into the situation with her begging and crying to him, saying that even though the case is closed and it looks as though an assassin killed Junior and Tariq killed the assassin, she knows it's not true, only for Don Carter to say he is going to go after Tariq for the sake of Junior. And so when it comes down to it, there's still that lingering situation there. A new problem has arisen because of the Junior situation. And we're going to see um, how that plays out. But I just want to say to all of you that it is your boy Bobby Beast here. I just want to say much love, much respect. Hold it down. And ooh.